Mikhail Astashov. And he's up against Tristan Chernov of uh, Canada. Chernov at uh, the age of 46. He was second in this event behind uh, Li Zhengzhou in Rio. He's upgrading here. Well, he might not be, of course. He was second, so he might uh, end up with the silver again. He'll be up against it against Astashov. Make sure everything's absolutely spot on. Uh, when you don't feel comfortable in the starting gate, they do need to sometimes dismount the bike and let the bike be placed again in the gate. I think it was indicating it was on a bit of an angle, so he's dismounted and they'll replace the bike into the gate. There we go. Turnov, meanwhile, on the other side of the track, very calm and composed, the 46-year-old, who spent much of uh, the last year do, keeping himself busy on his bike. Not many people were able to do, but he got out and he did the BC Epic 1,000-kilometer ride through British Columbia. He completed an Everesting challenge. There he is in uh, December last year. Very relaxed is uh, Tristan Chernov. Well, they're about to race for the gold medal here in Tokyo. Gold medal at stake here in the C1 3000 meter individual pursuit. Mikhail Astashov for the Russian Paralympic Committee and Tristan Chernov of Canada. Yeah, we're going to see a great race here. Astashov goes out very comfortably. Has a little bit of a lead already over Chernov of Canada. Break the world record in qualifying, but this is for the medal. This is for the medals that uh, really count. And he's got nicely up now, one and a half seconds after 500 meters. It's a blistering start. He looks comfortable, Astashov. He looks very, very comfortable. He's going out super hard, chasing Chernobyl of Canada. Well, three and a half seconds already after a thousand meters. He continues at this pace. He's going to have Shinova in sight, and that's really going to assist him. He's going out super, super fast. How does Shinov uh, deal with this? He's going at a steady tempo, but nothing like us to shop at the moment. Look how close he is already. meters and Astrashnov really wants to close in on Chernova of Canada just making his way into the same straight that will give him motivation nearly five seconds so Chernova's just got to get his head down here and keep ticking it over don't uh, get too panic by it He's closing in, isn't he? Just under six and a half seconds now. Yeah, once you have that rider in sight, that extra motivation incentive, it just makes, really does make you go that little bit faster having a rider to chase. Astashov now closing in on Chernova of Canada. Once he does so, well, he's closing in now.
and he's got to get past him, and that is the race. A phenomenal performance by Astashov. He takes the gold medal. We don't see too much expression just yet, but a gold medal at the Paralympics here in Tokyo 2020. Well, utterly dominant ride in the final from uh, Mikhail Astashov. He broke the world record in qualifying and then uh, in this final of the gold medal, he uh, put Tristan Chernova to the sword by uh, powering through and eventually catching him inside the last uh, thousand meters. Yes, you've got the gold medal. 